All right, audio check, video check. We're online. Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Muckle Extremes. I am your charming, self-proclaimed yet still humble host. And today we're picking back up with some RPG goodness, starting off in the world of Guild Wars 2. Possibly some last epoch later, if we can get that going. Oh, <laughs> we had a fun conversation here to get started. Dumb millennial D Doctor, casual geeky girl. Monstrosity's bot with the savagest of insults today, and White Tiger, how y'all doing? Um, okay, so a bunch of stuff I want to do when I started off today. I've already farmed out the other guild hall. Let me know if the music is too loud. I was listening to the VOD from last night and this music was almost inaudible, so I turned it up just a tiny bit, but let me know if it's too much and I'll change it. Um, Doc, you said you wanted to farm out my home instance, so I'm going to invite you. Uh, please be ready over there in just a minute. And if anybody else wants to mine my home instance as well, uh, let me know quickly so that we don't slow the stream down for it. Uh, da, 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 da. His pay has been docked. Maybe you should project your voice. Well, in the VOD, my voice was quite loud and the volume was uh, hardly audible, so I just upped the volume a little bit. I don't want to get much louder than I already am because I already wake my kid up sometimes. He's right there. His room is above uh, this room. As soon as I said it, Tiger, I was like, I can't think of a way to say this where Tiger, that pervy cat, is not going to turn this into something naughty. There you go. Uh, meet us in Ratasum in just a minute, if you want to uh, mine it. Okay, daily login, bag of XP. Uh, Matt, I'm going there right now. So Matt messaged me right before I went live and asked if I could do the upgrade for the uh, PvP building. About to find out. I guess not that. Uh, this thing, I guess. Um, we can't. Uh, we need 2,000 Ethereum, and the most the Guild Hall can hold right now is 1,500. So we're at the same problem we were at yesterday, where the Ethereum capacity at the mine needs to be upgraded. And we have been working on that. I think what we need right now is runes of holding from a tailoring merchant, and also, um, I think it was Elder Wood Planks. And then I donated like 400 mithril bars yesterday. I can check real fast, hang on. I bought upgrades for capacity also. Oh, well, I'm headed over there right now because I was just going to get you the accurate information, but if you've already got it, that's cool. Oh, oh shoot, hold on. Stuck in a tree. There we go. Oh, hey, it's a map. Let's see. Ethereum capacity too. Oh yeah. Okay, so I can upgrade this right now. Boop. Oh, bother. You awesome. Now, uh, so it's gonna take 2,000 minutes to get enough Ethereum to be able to do the PvP upgrade. But uh, I have done the mine upgrade. Thank you, Metacher, for filling in the rest of those mats. And hopefully sometime tomorrow I can upgrade the PvP hull. Use the influence. Huh? Boost Ethereum production by 5% for one minute. 5% for one minute? So we get 1.05 Ethereum for that minute? Yo, am I understanding that right? Because that sounds really dumb. Because you get one per minute. And this boosts it by 5%. That means you'd get 1.05 per minute. For one minute. I've got what you need. Hold on. Slash wiki. Oh, like, that again? sounds terrible. Converts 100 influence to one minute of boosted Ethereum production. Um... Okay, I, I don't see why that's good. <laughs> we just got a YouTube subscriber named The Power of Anime. I love it. We've got the power of anime and God on our side. Mm. Oh, also, uh, shoot, it's not up there on the live feed. Hang on just a second. I saw it over here on the dashboard. When we were offline, we got a new uh, follower last night. So, Mucklock Douglas Bartholomew Reginald Esquire the Fourth welcomes you, Dev Element, to the Bone Zone. Mm. By the way, I love how this guy did his name. It's very clever. Hold on. 
It's like that. So it's development, almost, but it's also dev element. I wonder if, they, if they're a developer, that makes it extra good. Uh, okay. So... Always be loyal to your crew. Tomorrow, um... I think it'll be done. It will have enough by tomorrow. But tomorrow, I will uh, play in to do the upgrade that Matt just gave us all the masks for, for the uh, PvP thing. And then the other thing on my priority list, now that we've got the mine at level 2, is to upgrade the synthesizers. We can upgrade them all to level 2, so the production of all of the free stuff in the guild hall will double. And that'll be so good. Okay, so now... I'm going to go over to my home instance. If you want to join me in uh, mining it out, join me right now, because I have to be there for you to go inside of the instance. Um, otherwise, uh, you might miss your chance for the day. Hey, Silver Fox. Thanks for that lurk, buddy. Appreciate you. Muck dances? Wait, what? When did I dance? Yeah. <laughs> oh, the char. What? No, 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 no. No one needs to see that. Char the char dance. Ugh. Uh, the Asura Domo Arigato is so much better. Dude, I thought that, because of the name of that clip, I thought you meant I was literally up at, like, dancing behind my chair. And I'm like, I don't remember doing that. Can you do the PvP arena first? Because if you do the Sentinel first, it'll take the source of... Oh, no, Matt, uh, yeah, if I wasn't clear on that, I will do the PvP one first. Because we've already got all of the mats for that, because of you. And then the Synthesizer will be the next thing after that. Since you provided all that stuff. Okay. Um, I'm in my home instance, DDoc and JJW, if you want to mine it out, uh, go ahead and get started. And let's see what we got for the day. Oh, I, once again, I forgot my quartz. I'm gonna have to get my quartz. Alright, exalted chest. Ooh, a yellow gear, nice, nice. Airship cargo, whack! Alright, uh, let's run over here. Get some airship parts. Sprocket gem. Is there a maximum on how many airship parts I can have? Do I need to make sure I'm not hitting a cap? I've got 3,365 right now. Uh, how do you have so many chests in your instance? I've been working on it, Matt, because any containers you get in your instance respawn every single day. So it's like an investment. You, uh, you get a node in your instance and you get to mine it daily. It, it slowly pays for itself and then becomes profit. Um, so I have been working on that. Uh, for example, those treasure chests are from each of the zones. Like, you purchase, uh, this one in, um, what is the name of that? Heart of Thorns of Tangled Depths. You purchase, uh, the Exalted Chest in, uh, Auric Basin, and you purchase the Airship Cargo in Verdant Brink, each of the zones where you would find them. You get the, uh, Candy Corn the sprocket generator and the quartz node from i think it was the laurels merchant the aurelium was an achievement it was very easy to solo and it just took me like an hour or two with a guide to do it and you got a ton of aurelium every day this i did spend a few gems on i had some leftover gems so i bought a few node packs from the store one of the node packs was three ore nodes so i get copper silver and gold every day I tried to join you, and I went to my own home. Um, try zoning out and approaching the door again, JJW. What about D-Doc? Doc, were you able to enter? Um, I did, let's see, what was the other stuff? Matt, the, uh, the other thing is the Living World instance that has uh, the, what is this called? Siren's Landing. You can purchase this. It's an Orion Oyster Tank. And as you can see, you get nine exotic oy uh, oyster materials every day that you do it. Uh, okay, hold on. I'll zone out because I have to buy the quartz anyway. I'll zone out, buy the quartz, and come up to the door at the same time as you guys. Give me just a second. Hey, Tiger. Thanks for the host, buddy. So some of the, the, well, not some, all of the guild quests reset today. So I'm, I forgot that was a Monday thing. I am super extra glad that you guys uh, helped me do those bounties yesterday. Ahorita uh, no viejoven. Hello. That is a very intense name. I love it. So I'm glad we got that stuff done. And then we could do some of the easy ones today. Being Monday, I will be spending a little bit of time on another game. Uh, but I plan to be here for at least an hour, maybe two. All right. Quartz. 
Uh, I just mined some. How many do I have on me right now? Eight. Uh, so I need 17. Okay, so I need 17 to make a charge quartz and fractal boxes. Do I already have some fractal boxes? Uh, I have 11, so 19 of those. All right. And pop. Okay, guys, I'm going up to my uh, the instance portal right now. So stand nearby if you would. All right, I'm clicking the button. It's asking Troll Factor if he wants to join me. So it looks like it worked that time. I don't know. You guys were in right as soon before I got there. I don't know why it worked. Okay, dude, go nuts. Um, the found bandit chest attacker was from the end of one of the Living World chapters. It, it's always in a different spot in your instance, but it shows up on the map. This but this fun. one gives some of the best stuff. And you get bandit crests from it every day and amberite, which is awesome. Uh, bloodstone crystals. I bought the bloodstone crystal from a merchant in Bloodstone Fin. And you can see you get uh, blood rubies and bloodstone dust from it. Uh, the leather rack, uh, this is another gem thing. You slap it each day and you get three stacks of random leathers. And this was the last thing I spent extra gems on, which was a pack of the three lowest level trees. And I'm doing all this with the gathering boost from the A skilled hall. So I can get critical harvest and get twice as much stuff. Uh, Anodic. Have no fear, Anodic is here. Hey, Anodic, what's up, buddy? By the way, I ran into Maya by accident last night while in game. Oh, that's awesome, Skids. Did you say hi or did you just, like, run past? And then I've also got um, this Crate Obelisk Shard, which I think this is also from Laurels, just like the three items down there. And each day I can combine 25 Quartz Crystals into a Charged Quartz, quartz here. And there's a lot of quests where you need Charged Quartz. And Charged Quartz is a account-bound item, so you gotta do it yourself. And it's a daily thing to combine it. What is that? Was that the freaking Slender Man? Why is Slender Man in my house? I've never seen him before. She recognized her guild. She was like, don't I know you? And I'm like, maybe? <laughs> yeah, I don't know what that was. Uh, looks like Doc Doc left the party. I, I don't know what's going on with him. Okay, well, I tried. I did try. Uh, by the way, Tiger, there's something I could purchase for uh, one silver that adds holographic kittens to my instance. And there, for one gold, I can buy a box of water guns to shoo the holographic kittens off of the furniture. <laughs> like, when I look at the list of nodes I can buy for my instance, those are on the list. Don't shoot them, that's mean. Uh, okay, I'm gonna give JJW just a second because he's almost done with his lap. I think Chip is in here. Hold on just a second. Oh, he's, what a troll. What a troll. He was in the windowsill when I started the stream. He must have uh, snuck around me at some point. Oh, hopefully he comes, he comes back and join us. He's been slacking lately. Thank you very much. No problem. Dude, that's part of the joy of upgrading the home instance is like literally if four people come in here, then for that day, it the home instance nodes paid out five times what they normally do. So it's it truly is an investment that just keeps growing. I'm a huge believer in the home instance nodes because there's not much else in the game that will just keep churning out money like that. I thought that curtain is a window. It is, it is, that's why I said a window sill. Can those pants unzip at the knees and become shorts? No, but in high school I did wear those. And the thing is, I would go, like, the whole summer with just the bottom halves zipped off. And then in the winter, I would just zip the things back on. But because the shorts were now sun-bleached, uh, my pants were very different colors past the knee. Okay. Let, uh... Da -da 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 -da. So, really quick here. Uh, since this finishes. Check this out, you guys. From... Like, here, all the way down, and then that row, and then that row, and then that row, skip the bags, and then this row. That was from mining out the two guild halls in my home instance. It's so much. It's so good. And look at that. Deposit all. Mmm. So good. All right, let's open this stuff. 
While I was at work today, I was occasionally logging in, hitting the world boss portal device, and just like slapping a world boss. <laughs> uh, what was it? Um, Tequadal killed me, and I'm like, all right, well, I got the loot. <laughs> no regrets. That reminds me, I need to repair my gear. All right. Salvage yellows. Okay. All right, I've got these four golem nodes I need to, or these four golem parts I need to turn in real quick. And I looked up earlier what to do with these. And they're actually for making an ascended backpack that looks like a, a tiny baby golem that rides on your back like he's in a baby carrier. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna use it, but it's a quest line I haven't done and that excites me. So I'm gonna turn these in. You're laughing at my, the pants of muck past. Yeah, I had the I had the zip off. So, dude, I was a function over form, which did not do great for any reputation I might have claimed to have. I was just like, oh yeah, get this one item. It's short sand pants. It was fine in the summer, but they, the material was so thin. I was always very cold in the uh, in the winter. My cold my cold milky calves. It's a good story. Should have added some Richard Greco to it. Now, Richard Greco always wore the Jeanco pants. I told you about that. Oh man, we got to get that defluorite. That's that stuff's high octane goodness. I need. Okay, so each of those mining nodes I got from Living World Season Three cost ten thousand unbound magic and fifty gold. And you look here, I'm getting some volatile magic from the defluorites. So unbound magic I get because of my mining tools. So I get those everywhere. Volatile magic I have to actually try for. By the way, the other day, one of those sharks jumping out of the water actually made contact with me and it ripped me off my mount and stunned me for like 10 seconds. So it actually is detrimental to have those things touch you. It's not just a prank. We thought it was just a for fun thing. Eat your fluorite chat. Difflorite. Difflorite. Dude, this guy's got the guitar sword. Look at him. Look at him. It's a rocker kitty tiger. It's a rocker cat. Why is he linking this? Oh, I have no idea. He must be giving himself a waypoint. All right. So there's this broken robot here, and any time while you're running around the zone that you find these yellow robot parts, you bring them to this guy. All right, replace his damaged left arm. Replace the right arm. Replace damaged circuitry. You said that last time. Replace damaged gravitic repulsion unit. Component accepted. Golem chassis fully functional. Please provide the requisite software. Uh, yeah, this is a skin unlocked. Inquest apparatus. Wait, what? Where is it? Okay, there we go. So check check it out. We got the weird little photon backpack thing, which clips horribly with the hat, but we have it now. Um, all right, what's next? Software module MV337 corrupted. Okay, so I'll have to Google that later. So there's a way to make this go all the way to Ascended, and you've got a, like a little robot with arms on your back when you're done with it. Um, but yeah, so we got that now. This was the first one, this one here. And then it just became this. Uh, waiting with bated breath for next playthrough of Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I I don't think I've ever beaten a Mario game in my life. Not like all the way through. You know, like I've played Mario at friends' houses on the Nintendo cartridge, you know, <laughs> the Nintendo cartridges as a kid. Uh, you know, where you get to the end of any level and it says the princess is in another castle. You stink. So that's that's it. I haven't done anything since then Mario related. That's it. That's it, dude. Do you plan to do PvP today? Um, because it's Monday, DDoc, I'm probably going to reserve some time for last epoch, so I don't know if I'll get to PvP today, buddy. Alright, I'm just going to get this really quick and then head out of here. 
What I will ask, um, and I'm doing this earlier than usual, so it won't surprise me if there's not enough people online yet. We've got a whole new batch of guild missions, including the super easy ones. Um, one of them is to do a single bounty uh, within 10 minutes. Do I have maybe four or more people who would be interested in helping me hunt down and assassinate a world mob that will drop some loot? Okay, DDoc will join. That's one taker. Do I have anybody else who might help me kill our, our world boss real quick? <laughs> yes. Yo, yesterday we hunted down a uh, kobold or whatever he was, a scrit that was uh, wanted for trying to keep a bear as a pet, and he literally was throwing baby bears at us. That was his main attack, and he almost killed us. I never said it was G-rated. I said it was PG. Yo, even in, like, most Disney movies, somebody is trying to kill somebody. Okay, capture, whatever. Going to enter into a car and truck show this weekend. Cool. You gonna show him your tank? Anybody else? Anybody else? Anyone else want to get in on doing a guild mission? There are rewards. Disney should stop getting away with paying off the USDA movie certification board. I don't know a lot of the words in that sentence. But sure, power to the people. Buy low, sell high. <laughs> Alright, looks like I might be asking too early, so we'll, uh, we'll put that on hold for now. And I want to do the next, so uh, Doc, thank you for being ready to do that. Um, I might, I'll probably ask again about this tomorrow after a Living Story chapter once I've been live for a bit longer. And for now, I'm gonna go do a sectional Living Story. USC Action Move Thrust is out of DC to drain the swamp. What? I, I don't wanna talk about politics. I have a question, how much boon duration is enough on a pa uh, power quick brand? to give perma quickness if you have a boon chrono in the other subgroup, but not running time warp. That is insanely specific, Marax. Um, Marax, the truth is I don't know the answer to that. Uh, however, the people that I raid with on Wednesdays definitely do. So if nobody in here in this chat channel knows the answer to that, um, I can tell you that uh, I flip for follows probably does or uh, Knocked Wolf. Those are two other streamers that uh, we do a joint stream on Wednesdays, and they've been raiding. I, last week was my first raid. They took me. Um, they probably have the answer to that very specific question. Uh, entering the Kensworth. Da, 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 da. What's your going on Quizmas coming out in support of Big Sandwich? I mean, are, are Big Sandwiches good? All right. Let me see. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, where is the current quest? There it is. Whew. Dormant Priory. Sandwich, did I hear sandwich? Om nom nom nom. Your questions now, chat. This is the only time I might reach chat. Fake news, Dumb Millennial. Man, we talk about draining the swamp, but suddenly Dumb Millennial is CNN in here with all these lies. So we are on the second to the last Living World chapter now. We just found out that Timey is still dying of turbo illness. Uh, we just lost Blish, and we're not yet at the Sky Scale thing. What's up, Kate? A moment. Before we go in, there's something I need to say. Sorry, you betrayed us again. I spent guarding the egg, watching over Irene as a hatchling in Taria. You raised her. But then she had you, and it felt like she didn't need me anymore. So I stepped away. Kate. No, let me say this. What's coming is dangerous. Aureen is terrified. I can feel it. She's going to need us. Both of us. Then it's a good thing we're both here. You guys can hear the NPC dialogue, Let's I hope. have that talk with Ogden. Ogden? I think that was the last dwarf guy. Hey Z Freddy. And hey Tyler, how you doing? Oh look, it's a sleepy Aureen next to 
dead glint, maybe? I'm That's trying to tell what that is. Signs. I'm due for a visit. Ogden, it's About good to... time you showed up. We're going to Thunderhead Keep. We are. To Glint's Dragon's Blood Forge. How else are we going to kill Kraunatoric? <laughs> a new Dragon's Blood Spear? You lost the first one? Not now. Before we broke the first destroy one. destroy the Crystal Dragon, Sion and Champion must first prove themselves. There's an extension of Glint's lair protected in the mists. A refuge for her Sion. From there, you can enter her trials. Oh, good. More trials. Why didn't you mention any of this before? We were waiting for the signs. Glint's egg hatching, the Lich's death. Oh, I remember that the part. The sands of Glint's power glass have begun to glow. Her scions already in the refuge. Go to Orin, complete the trials. Oh, we can see Orin again. Out and meet you at Thunderhead Keep with the pact. Uh, enter Glint's lair. Here we go. Whoa. All right, that's a trip. Can't use a mountain here. Comfort, Orin. Oh boy. Orin, we haven't thought much about all this from your perspective, have we? <laughs> nope. This legacy killed your mother, killed your brother, and that vision of it killing you. But I know one thing for certain. Glint would never tell you to do this if there was no hope. You're not alone. We'll all be with uh, not right now, Matt. There's not enough people up for it right now. I, I checked on who all was willing to do missions just minutes ago, and Doc was the only response. Join Orin as her champion. Um, oh, walk over here, apparently. Stand on the flower thing? I'll wait for you. Okay. Uh, I'm 19, so we're working this summer before I go to University of Wallace, so I get so easy in the Honda Farm full time tomorrow. Nice! Dude, your your first job changes you. It'll, uh, in my case, it really got me out of my shell. I was no good at even answering a phone call for a stranger before my first job. And of course, I hated it at the time, but looking back on it, I needed it to be a full person. Must prove that you can strike as one. Yeah, we killed uh, the the fire god guy doing that. Is waiting to be born. Oh, gotcha, Tyler. Gotcha. I'll let him be uh, easy peasy My for you. Followers and I developed the resonance crystals that made possible. The oh, that's a glint talking. Spear. Creating the crystals, forging the spear. Put some traps down, don't mind me. The channeling of powerful magic. Assist Orin in absorbing volatile magic. That absorbing magic comes naturally, but the power, its temptations, may exact a price. Whoa! Champion, this magic is powerful and dangerous. Yo, she's dying. What do I do? Do I stand in the red? There's no way I'm supposed to stand in the red on purpose. Oh, d okay. I just smash my face in and it hurts. I mean, like this really hurts her. I, mean, I can't do that for very long. Come on, please leave combat. Oh, 
Do I need to go to my druid build for this? Like... Oh, there we go. The bar's finally moving. Okay. Oh my gosh. Alright, did we power her up? Power has many uses, Zion. By choosing to share it and heal wounds, you strengthen your bond with mortals. Remember that bond. As the power grows, so will the dangers and the temptations. Oh, I can't see the pizza very well. Alright, got it. Okay. Seems like the further inward of the pizza slice you are, the less damage you're taking per second. So I was too close to the edge earlier. Go! Oh, come on. I totally dodged that. You're a big fat phony. Why won't anyone help me? Oh. Thank you for the heal, Lorraine. Well done. When Elder Dragons gorge on magic with abandon, the world falls out of balance. We have no choice but to act. To, to, to use power responsibly is to know when and how to share it. And when not, to use it at all. Now, continue to the next trial. Portal, I'm guessing? Oh, we stand on the Majigars again? Oh! All right, what's this trial about? She just made a big point of saying when not to use it. Magic must be captured and stored before it can be used to your advantage. The crystal before you will absorb magic released by branded creatures. Okay. Charge the crystal with magic from the branded. All right, so I probably... Oh, dang it, I got knocked down immediately. Okay. All the traps. It's working. Six feet tall, invigorating. Aureen, that one's not in the. There we go. Woo, Aureen with the laser. I dig it, girl. Good. Now you shall see how this captured magic can. Cheese is a loaf of milk. Loaves of milk are delicious. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. I'm not sure yet, Z Freddy. Ideally, after this uh, this um, Living World chapter, I'd like to do a couple of guild missions before I go over to Last Epoch. If there's excess time, then Fractals or PvP. Hey, Anodic. Uh, charge the southern crystal. I don't really have a sense of direction here. Oh, here we go. Okay, Aureen. Let's charge these crystals. You know what to do. Aureen, bring them over here. There we go. Oh my gosh, like, each of one of these mobs has, like, a knockdown. Alright, does that veteran want to come over here? Man, I still need to repair my gear. I forgot that I said I was going to do that earlier. Charge the western... Oh, okay. I gotta, mo I gotta move over here now.
veteran branded ogre. Who's a big boy? Oh man, I've got like permanent slow on me. I do healing spring for purposes of Condi cleanse. Okay, that one's done. Now this crystal over here. Just gonna go ahead and trap it, precast some damage. Nice, the vet mob died over here. I'll take it. Deep cheese. Yo, okay, here's a story involving cheese where I was an embarrassment. Uh, so I'm going to work one day. Uh, I bring my lunch, which is a bunch of leftover taco fixins. Hold on. Cliffhanger. So I bring all the stuff to make some tacos. One of the things I bring is a packet of cheese. And my, uh, one of my coworkers is saying like, oh, what'd you bring? Uh, da 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 da. And I was like, yeah, I've got cheese in the fridge. And he's like, oh, is it white cheese? I'm like, no, it wasn't white cheese. And he's like, well, what was it? I saw you carrying it. I'm pretty sure that was white cheese. I was like, no, on the bag. It was, uh, it was something Mexican. And he's like, what? And I was like, hang on. And I go over and pulled it out. And I'm like, yeah, see, it's Mexican. It says queso bl blanco's white, isn't it? And he's like, yeah, queso blanco's white cheese, you idiot. I called it fancy Mexican cheese. What was that supposed to do? Now you see how we forged a weapon capable of piercing Kralkatorik's armor. The dragon's blood spear. No, I don't get that at all. Experience for yourself the power of the dragon's blood spear. Is she offering to stab me? Oh, it's right here. Uh, hurl the dragon's blood spear at your target, piercing all enemies along its path. Branded targets are dealt severe damage and vulnerability. Woo! Oh, I got interrupted. No. Woo, 20k on that one. Uh, oh my god, look at Discord. Oh, hang on. Let me get out of combat. will do. <laughs> Chirp. Use this knowledge in the battle ahead. Forge weapons and strike your enemies. Now, proceed to the final trial. Uh, where's the portal? Ah, there it is. Okay. Uh, what's the, the, the Discord memes channel? <laughs> what? What? Why did you make this? What did I do that makes this relevant? I, mm, I don't even know. Welcome to Flavortown was ages ago. Ages ago. Got a new toy today, been wanting one for a few years. <laughs> oh my gosh. Muck Fiari. Begin the third trial. Ah! Defeat the branded horde. Why does Glint just keep branded in here? Oh wow. Summon courage. Aurene, wait. We need to work together. 
<laughs> As Aureen solos the bosses. Reunite with Aureen. Their illusions. Gotta keep them somewhere. Exclamation Muck Fiari. What, just have that silly gif pop up? We looked into that one day. It was kind of... It was a... It was a task. Making it so gifs can pop up when you type a command. It was an absolute task. Naughty Aureen. Get the, get the squirt bottle. Scion. You fear what Krakatoric might make of you, champion. You fear for her survival and the world's. Defeat branded Aureen. Whoa, what? Find courage together. Aureen, don't be afraid. All right, I'm. I'm right here. With oh my God! I'm nigh invincible. Accelerating. I'm just breaking the bar as often as I can. There we go. That's not you, Aureen. Whoa, it what? Will be. Conquer your fears complete. Execute a powerful co-op attack against Branded Aureen with Aureen. Whoa. Lost target. Oh, no. Oh, line him up. Can I shoot them while they're in the air? There they are. I'm nigh invincible. Ah, took off again. Last one, I think. All right, they're going to come back down, I imagine. Oh, get your 1% health butt back down here. I chose you. Man. Is the enemy dragon's breath hurting its own branded? It looks like it might be. Yeah. We beat the illusion. Well, defeated your worst fears may manifest. Remember, work together, fight together, and triumph together. Now, now I have a gift of understanding for each of you. Scion, gift of understanding? Child. Champion, come forward and learn how this long journey began. Uh, receive Glint's gift. Is it gold? I need some money. Uh, Homeworld server, whatever you wish to call it. I've been a very long time since I've touched this game. Uh, I still have my game CD for this. I wonder if anyone's still alive over there. 
Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, any server that would have, like, an insanely low population would have been merged with another one. So, th so your characters still exist. They might just not be on the same server you thought they were on. With you, champion, I share my true legacy. Here, hold on, I'm gonna pause this. And Krakatorik's greatest secret. Uh, okay, so we go through each of these things. He foresaw the possibility of a world at peace. Oh, they just took my spear away. Strife between dragons and mortals. A world without him. The Requiem. <laughs> it terrified him. He demanded I help prevent it from coming to pass. But, but where he saw doom, I saw. <laughs> She's like, get the world will be great without you. It's fine. I believe in this future, this fragile, Mesmerizing floaty powerful rock. hope. But what my daughter must do will seem impossible to her. Uh, I hope I sleep better tonight than I have the past few nights running on four hours of sleep 72. Oof, Vader. Dude, I mean, go to bed now. Go to bed early if you need to, buddy. I understand. Now, now leave this place. I will open the way to Thunderhead Keep. Uh, hey, AJ94, how are you? We are good. We're doing a Living World mission right now. I'm going to see if we got the people for some guild missions and then do a little last epoch. Oh, what's going on now? Is that Aureen? Or is that like Baby Glint? Look at this char. Yeah, it's a dragon! Okay, so she said she was opening the way to Thunderhead Peaks. So is this where I get access to a new zone? Oh, not yet. Oh, what's up, Kaith? Oh, you made a little campfire. Oh, Finally. I knew you'd oh I knew it. As soon as I saw the campfire, I was like a bunch of time passed it in it. Two days. It felt like a fraction of that. Aureen, you feel different. I think we both are. We passed the trials. Ready as we'll ever be. Then let's go. They're waiting for us at Thunderhead Keep. Let's go, Aureen. Let's go, Fyshrub. Fyshrub and Aureen constantly fight because they both think they're my favorite. Shh. There's Tiny's our way my out. Favorite. Anything else to say before we jump? Guess not. Hey! Oh, I didn't even get to see the, the rewards. Dude, I have a white noise generator in my bedroom and in my son's bedroom. And I mean, actually, they're uh, like air purifiers that we just use for white noise, but still, same thing. 100 head of cattle and 200 acres of corn and soybeans. What? Kaith has a larger flock. Oh my gosh. Is Kaith that? isn't even involved in this. Feel him. All right. You haven't met Orion in person. I never expected to feel his presence again. Oh, reward tracks. Dragon. She's a Many. very special dragon. Scion and champion complete. While I track down Ogden. All right. Let's get our bearings. Where are we? We're in Deldramar Front. Okay. Alright. Uh, can I... Yes, I can. Where... We want a waypoint so we can get back here. Do I have a waypoint for this zone? Sure doesn't look like it. Okay, we gotta keep going until we get a waypoint. Pack trade cash? Oh my gosh, come on. This ramp is too steep for wheelchairs. Unacceptable. Turn on giveaway bot? Yes, the giveaway bot. Uh, I, I'm almost certain it's online. Yes, it's online. Hey, Jebstar, thanks for the lurk, buddy. Whoa, there are some uh, elevation differences in here. Holy cow. I'm sorry! Oh, 
Oh, bunch of sad faces. Commander, I take it the trials went well. Tell me you're so big and strong. Glint's, Glint's secret forge under an ancient dwarven keep. I've seen better. Logan's here with the pact. Same with rocks and the old. Oh, Logan and rocks? She gave us a ride after I filled her in. The whole crew's gearing up for Crockett tour. Do I hear singing coming from the forge? The Zephyrite Choir, an integral part of the forging process. My people built this place, but the Zephyrites and Exalted have cared for it since the days of Glint. Oh, they have, Everything huh? Everything still works. We've got an army to equip with Dragon's Blood weapons. Speak to the Forge Master, Helena. She'll get you started. Uh, Timey wants to say something. Timey, how are you feeling? You look a little tired. See? I told you, you need to rest. Tell her, Commander. She never listens to me. She's doing fine, thanks. Gork, why don't you update the Commander on our progress, huh? We've been using the data from... the tracker. We... it... It's giving us way the more... The tracker is his brother. Hulk's vitals, the magic he's channeling, plus all the tracking data. We're seeing him take real damage from Glint's army. And every time we slam one of his rifts shut. Excellent. We want him maximally weak before we face Maximally him. weak. We were also able to evacuate several villages before his minions broke through. Every time you get the word out, you two are saving lives. We three. Ah, oh, Dead brother says hi. Okay. Waypoint. Uh, over there. There's one to the west. Okay, do these rooms connect down here? Whoa. Oh, that's cool. All right. I'm not going to talk to that dude right now. Oh, my God. I just said we're not talking right now. Uh, I can repair my gear. Master, heard you can arm us to fight an elder dragon. Indeed, the dragon's blood forge is ready, but we will need a special oil to quench the weapons, or they'll shatter. Can I spit the on them? Extracted on the ice flow to the southwest. I sent your friends to retrieve some, but they haven't returned. You probably sent I'll Bram. He's pretty slow. All right, I want to just look at this place. I wonder if this does damage. Oh, yep, I'm on fire. Yep, it does. <laughs> fire hurts, chat. Well, this is, uh, oh, what is that? Hold on, guys, there is a mystery afoot. Oh, man. Ah, do I have to land on top of the, ah, Cinnamon's on fire. that work? What? What am I supposed to do there? So I can start hitting that button. Do I have to get a second jump off before the channel completes? You need a sky scale to hover? That's impossible. Okay, hold on. Let me try something different here. All right, this time, I'll hit it when I go down. Oh no, I thought I was so clever. All right, hold on. All right, hit it on the way down. Wait a second, go back up. She just branded the ground we're standing on. We're lucky she didn't kill anyone. And in case it slipped anyone's mind, she's Krakatorik's granddaughter. Will you all be quiet? She's trying to tell us- No sky scale needed.
And then he steps on her. Oh, she's Super Saiyan 17, or I don't know what number they're on now. The sound and the video is not matched up. Uh, I mean, I didn't intentionally skip ahead. I, if you're able to get it with the rabbit, you're clearly supposed to be doing this right now. Right? <laughs> I, uh, for anyone wondering, because I feel very clever about that. I started the the casting of the animation and then got back up there right when it finished the animation. It's the same logic they use when uh, rogues are executing you in PvP, and they start the execution channel, teleport away, and then teleport back within range right before the channel finishes. It's it's garbage, but it works apparently. <gasps> There we go. Let's see what this is. Okay, a little view of the forge. A little side of the- oh, there's a jail. What's going on? I was just trying to think of the one with the blue hair tiger. When they went, uh, I guess, no, it wasn't God mode when he went red hair. I only saw bits and pieces of those episodes. Uh, okay. All right, let me keep, let me pull the audience once again here. Does anybody wish to assist me with a guild bounty mission? We would need, uh, hopefully, ideally, at least four more people besides myself. Okay, so Z Freddy. I see Z Freddy. Is anybody else interested? Oh, there's a. Is that a volatile merchant? Yeah. Oh, right there, guys. Dragon, Crystal, Home, Instant, Snowed. There's another one to work on. Uh, d -daw, Okay, Anodic. It's a bounty. So we will get a target, and we'll have to go find it and kill it within, like, ten minutes. That's the first mission. And depending on how many people say they want to assist, we can do more than that. Yeah, ten minutes to find and kill one target is the first one. So, let's see, Z Freddy, D-Doc, Z Freddy, Anodic, you want to help? I like your dinosaur, thank you, AJ. His name is uh, Chris Pratt, <laughs> I was not the one who named him. It's not booze, but I'll take it. Wow, I give this, the like, guy who's dying of thirst some water, and he goes, it's not booze. You need a bit more, be a bit more inspiring if you plan on boosting morale. What? I am so inspiring. I've killed two dragons and a god. You guys are just picky about your morale. Wait, hold on. What was that? What was that button? Dead. It's hard to keep fighting, but I know you have it in you. Oh, I'm happy now. Where is someone who's thirsty? There's one. I do. Thanks for that, Commander. What's this bar above my head? Hmm. I can after this event. Uh, so Zork will join soon. Anodic don't have a straight response yet. Um, there's a supply cache. What hope do we have? Whoa, 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 whoa! Hold on. You need some pep. Oh, it fills up. 
our progeny. You won't live, but some random kid in the future that you hold no attachment to will like what you did here today when you die. Excellent. It's hard to keep fighting, but I know you have it in you. <sighs> Halfway done. Can I cheer these guys on yet? Nope. Need to be a bit more inspiring. Either Kronkatorik ends the world, or we end him. Oh, just in time. Am I inspiring enough? Nope. <laughs> these guys are so picky. Ah. Nihilus Muck. I can't. Alright, Anodic's gonna join. Chad, do we have any more that wanna join us? I know y'all have the power. I know y'all want some boss loots. It's not booze, but I'll take it. Ah, there's one. Either Krakatorik ends the world, or we end him. Really? It's the bar's almost full. Come on. Our project will tell stories about what we did here. All right, this should finish it. What's wrong with you? Pick yourselves up. Are you the Ash Iron and Blood Legions, or are you a book club? <laughs> Let's just insult a whole bunch of char to their What's face. What's a book club? <laughs> What's a book club? I don't know. Let's cheer. Accelery. The king of... Oh, wow. I'm surprised that name made it through the filter. But welcome to the stream. Thank you for the lurk. Appreciate you. Mondays aren't very hopping. That's weird, because it's the reset day. All right. Let's see what's... Uh, we could still try the, uh, the, the one bounty. Uh, oh, here we go. Oh, it's Gorik. Branded Mass. Mini Olmacan Rocks? Oh, we can get a tiny rocks with the goofy looking shoulder pads. Very, very expensive rocks. I can't afford it. I don't I don't have the thing. I don't have enough. Running a barracks can't be that okay. from symbolic problems. Alright, Anodic, Z Freddy, and D Dot, get ready. I will start this and we'll see where we need to teleport to, okay? This one should be fairly easy. We will find out. Launch mission. Trillia Midwell. Wiki Trillia Midwell is our target. Um, da -da 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 -da. Uh, location. Fields of Ruin. Ascalon. Fields of Ascalon's to the northeast. Uh, Blaze Ridge Steps. Where's the Fields of Ruin? Fields of Ruin. And she's down here around the stronghold of Ebon Hawk. All right, so here's the map of her patrol. This white line. So fairly simple area. Should be able to find her pretty quick. Um, I'm going to change to healing mode, Please, just in case help. we need it. PvE druid, load. Alright. Okay, I'm a healer now. Let's see if I can find this person. Alright, let's do this. Roller Beetle is best beetle! We got a turn. Oh my gosh, we made the turn. Oh shoot, someone just said found. No, I'm going the wrong way! I'm coming back, Trillia. Our Priestess Carissa. Yo, we covered some ground there.
Wow, she's like almost patrolled back to where I zoned into the back. Ah, we crashed. Huge flipping map. Oh, dude, the world map is massive in this game, AJ. Okay. Let me summon the spirits. Mess her up. Oh, gosh, ow. Yo, these uh, columns of tornado rock or whatever. Pretty intense. Ow! Oh my god! <laughs> Nerf weavers! Hit her with CC if you got it. She has a CC bar. Nice. Muck is a professional chat. Uh, oh. <laughs> I see it. Ah, uh, yes, I am a professional. I go to the bathroom and come back to a webpage stream. Oh, I'm sorry. You gotta keep me in line. Uh, okay. Is there any other really easy ones? There's race. That's a 31 minute one. I don't want to do that right now. A 10 player, a 15 player, a world v world. PvP top stats and challenge. Okay, so none of, none of the others could really be done with this number of people other than race, but I don't really want to do that right now. So, okay, cool. All right, thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Let me see what we got in the bags we got. Salad yellows. Rare and valuable. All right. I thought I was going crazy for a second. Columns of white cookies. Uh, no, it's like these. T it, it looked like tiny volcanoes erupted out of the ground, but then it was like mud tornadoes were swirling up, and it was making like solid pillars that I couldn't throw projectiles through. We should do challenge this week. Challenge. Challenge what? Challenge raid? Challenge PvP? What, what are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, we found the bounty really quick, Z Freddy. Guild mission challenge? Uh, we did it yesterday, so we definitely will try it again. I mean, do you mean the hard one? Hard mode race. Ugh. Ugh! Like, we did every mission uh, last week other than the World v. World Ranker. I know, I'll watch the VOD. Oh, wait. Oh no, I wanted to do a jump there, it didn't work. Oh wow, she's already respawned. I just passed the lady that we just killed. Uh, I thought her respawn would be longer than that. Oh man. I'm just, I'm just playing with the roller beetle, guys. I haven't had an area this uh, wide and open to do this in. This is cool. I gotta do some of the uh, the races, and so so I can uh, get more practice with this thing. Uh, is this game uh, is this a beginner friendly MMORPG? I wanted to start playing my first, and was trying to figure out which one I wanted to take control of my life. Talkin, this one is awesome, and it has a very good community. And I'll tell you a couple of quick reasons why. Um, one, it's the whole core game is free. If you decide you like it, you could purchase the expansion packs, but you could try it for literally hundreds of hours without spending any money. And uh, that link right there um, is the uh, link to download it for free. I encourage you to give it a shot. But there are some aspects to this game that other MMOs don't have, such as you get experience for, kill for resurrecting a, a nearby player that's down or that's injured. Um, you, if someone is fighting a mob and it's, even if it's low health and you hit it, you get a copy of the loot. So it makes people constantly, tr you know, assist other people that are in combat 
rather than try to steal a kill, which is something that a lot of other MMOs have. Um, if, uh, if I was fighting a rare mob in some other MMOs, it would benefit you to let me die, then steal the mob for yourself. In this one, people will constantly help you out, make your life easier, and you all get a copy of the loot. Um, they will assist you when you're down because they're rewarded for it, and it just, the end result is a community of very friendly people. Do people still play this game? Yeah, um, Tiger, you saw the numbers last. How many million people are still playing this game? I mean, yeah, it's it's still quite active, Bobby. It's still quite active. They just had a uh, content update just uh, just a couple, like a week or two ago. Uh, the last DLC came out. Uh, do I do Path of Fire for the hero point train so I can unlock Vappy? Um, so Path of Fire hero points were largely soloable. Uh, there's more hero point trains for Heart of Thorns because those were very tough. So at Heart of Thorns, you often see hero point trains. Path of Fire, most people just go do it themselves because it it's, doesn't take long. Or not that it doesn't take long, that there's a lot of traveling involved, but it's not so difficult that you need to group up with people. Um, if you were like a fragile thief, I could see needing assistance. Most people would not. Um, 1.5 million active accounts worldwide. There you go. Thanks so much, guys. Isn't there a third version coming out soon? So Talcan, right now there's Guild Wars 2, and it, it has the Heart of Thorns expansion and the Path of Fire expansions. Um, let me go to my story list here. Here we go. So there was the original game, Scarlet's War. You can't. It was a limited time event in game. You can't do that anymore. Living World. These are all DLCs. Don't worry about those right now, but they are available if you if you want to do them. Heart of Thorns is the first major expansion. Living World Season 3, DLCs. Path of Fire is the second major expansion. And Living World Season 4 is where we are now, and these are DLCs. Ayo, I just bumped up a bottle of Coke, you want some? I've had a couple of cans of Coca-Cola today, so I'm okay at the moment, but I do thank you for the offer. All right. Where to go now? Um, you know, it's definitely quieter in here tonight as far as, like, guildies go. So there's a lot that we can't do right now. So I think what I'll probably do... Hmm. You know what? I'll show you guys one rare mob I started killing each day just two days ago, and then I'll switch over to the uh, other game that we do on Mondays. Talkin', thank you for that follow, buddy. Mark Luck Douglas, Bartholomew, Reginald Esquire, the fourth welcomes you, Talkin98, to the Bone Zone. Mmm. Appreciate you. All right, let me switch over to my Soul Beast build. So this is actually a gold elite mob. He drops that ship in a bottle looking item I needed for Treasure Hunter that we saw in the auction house that sells for like 100 gold. So I found a way to kill him solo each day, and I'm going to show you guys what, what I was doing. He's a tough cookie, though. He's inside that boat. Now, we're in ore right now, City of the Undead. Ah, shoot. Crud. All right, let's go ahead. We're, we're gonna be fighting right downstairs, so we're gonna go ahead and kill some of this stuff. Oh, I got feared. So we're on a uh, ship that is uh, sort of wrecked. All right, I'm gonna throw some tr uh, snake and fire traps on the ground. And just shank this guy to death. All right, those pirates are dead. Alright. Sharpen the weapon. Alright, try to AoE these down. Alright. Oh, does it not reset at the same time as the server does its resets? Well, I can show you guys the room anyway. Maybe this knowledge will be helpful for some of you. Hey, Varenia, thank you for that follow. 
Muck like Douglas Bartholomew me, Reginald Esquire the fourth welcomes you, Vorania, to the Bone Zone. Mmm. And guys, the Bone Zone does have benefits. Every Friday I do a giveaway of a Humble Bundle gift package. That Humble Bundle package has roughly $100 worth of video games in it. Um, if you want to get in on that, type exclamation giveaway and it has instructions for the command to type if you want to get a raffle ticket. And you purchase the raffle tickets for those giveaways with Muck Bucks. Um, that is simply the local currency you get every minute you have my stream open. So by supporting me, I basically give you guys a chance to win a lottery every single Friday. Alright, so this huge treasure chest right here, when you open it once a day, it's empty and a gold elite, like the, the group ones, uh, pirate pops out. I found out by using dot damage, I can kite it in circles around the room and after a couple minutes I can kill it. And one of the things it can drop is that 120 gold uh, item that I need for the treasure hunter achievement. Of course, anybody could uh, want it just to sell it. This item right here, Rotbeard's treasure. And for perspective, my life savings is 240 gold after playing this game quite a long time. So that is a lot of money. All right, so I guess I don't need to be here. So let's just go ahead and pop on out. Okay, one second, I'm turning the ceiling fan. I'm gonna see if I can find Chip real quick. to join us tonight or if he is just going to uh, dip out. You want to get on your throne? Uh, I love that I could put 30 stacks of poison on a foe. Oh yeah, D-Doc. If, uh, if I have sharpening stone active and I just do like an axe two, it puts 10 stacks. But <laughs> it's insane. I've gotten, now some of the stacks are very weak and some of the stacks are very strong, but I can get like 20 plus stacks in PvP on someone really quick. Muck, muck, muck. Sleeping bear dunes, national lake shores, miles of sandy beaches and bluffs towering above Lake Michigan. This national lake shore located along the northwest coast of the lower peninsula of Michigan stretches across 35 miles of mainland Michigan shoreline. What? Why are you telling me this? <laughs> what? At first I thought you were sending me a tongue twister, but that just seems like something you copy-pasted from Wikipedia. Alright, let's open this up. Alright. Uh, can... Why wouldn't I tell you this? Can you do it constantly? I mean, I can't constantly put 30 sex points off foe. I constantly put 10, 20 sex off foe. hilarious. No, you're right. I can't usually do 30. I, sharpening Stone puts 10 on someone really quickly, and Axe 2 puts 5, and then like every auto with a short bow puts 1 stack, so I can rat- If I just do Sharpening and then start autoing, I can easily get 20 to 25 before they start falling off. I guess if I did Sharpening Root Auto, that would be a lot really quick, but Poison? No, I can't do that as a Ranger. Uh, okay. So with that, um, seems like Guild Wars 2 is really quiet tonight, but we got a few things done. Oh, we didn't feed the monsters, so we can do that really fast. Or get the fractal keys. I'm suddenly remembering so much stuff. Hang on just a second. Hold on just a second. Hold up. Wait a minute. All right, uh, Imperial Fragments. Now this is a fun. And... Sentient Aberration. Okay, and get this. I'll be on my way. All right, monsters getting fed. 
All right, and then the fractal keys, then we're done. And then we'll do a little bit of last epoch tonight. Um, for those of you that just joined my channel for the very first time, I stream every single night after 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and almost every night it's Guild Wars. On Mondays, I tend to mix it up with another game just to spice things up a little bit. Um, and today is Monday, so we're going to be doing that in just a little bit here. Uh, additionally, Father's Day is in just under two weeks on June 16th. Sweet. Maybe I'll get a pizza or something. Why was there a dead guy in town there? Stuck on a game bug. Five attempts at quest and client disconnects each time. Oof. Um, I, I've been, I reinstalled this game like two, three months ago, Toffle. I haven't hit anything like that. You checked, like, the integrity of your game files and all that jazz? I should also state she has been terminally... Uh, wait, whoa, hold on, what? My cousin gets two texts from my old phone number. They were just gibberish. She thought I was having a stroke. Though I should also state she has been terminally ill for 10 years. Sometimes her meds screw with her. Oh my gosh. That went from funny to a dark turn. Alright, let's open up these containers we just got. Okay, sell this stuff. Okay, and let's uh, open up the fractal boxes now. Deeply discounted fractal key. And open, open. Okay. And sell. Putting, uh, that was about 15 gold. All right, cool. All right, so tomorrow in Guild Wars 2, what I would like to do, if we can get the people to uh, do fractals, if we've only got like five people up for doing stuff, if we've got more than that, I wanna get some more of these guild missions done. And hopefully by then the, um, what is the, the, the ore in the guild hall? Hopefully we have enough of that so that we can construct that PVP building. Oh, there it is, the uh, Ethereum. Uh, once we get 2,000 Ethereum, I can construct the PvP building um, in the arena that Matacker just funded. We can get that done. 